Water God TV. Y'all know we talk about health, wealth, and a better understanding of self. You know I had to tap into Charlemagne the God. So I feel bad for the Breakfast Club because it's like I feel like now they reaching for certain topics that it's just killing the whole principle that Breakfast Club stands on. This used to be you know, a show for the, you know, for the culture. Now it then turned into a political party show. So they got Nikki Haley on here and they just talking about Charlemagne the God does his same speech. He always want to bring up systematic racism. Make sure you get your free water test at Invirely.com. Here we got Mr. Pollock. He had a cornfield. He took advantage of a free water test from us. And this is what we found in this water. We found sulfur. We found hardness. And we solved these problems with an easy fix of two tanks. So get your free water test today. Stay blessed. Click the link below. You always want somebody to talk about race and figure out where you is with race just so it can cause some commotion, right? That's his whole MO, is to just bring up race so it can, you know, cause some commotion, so some, you know, races can be in the comments. It's all for clicks and likes. I understand he knows the button to push to try to get into the algorithm, but this interview was trash. It was it was definitely clickbait. I don't think this woman stands a chance at getting into the presidency. But she says she says something to say that it's either gonna be her or Kamala Harris to be president. And then she goes to bash Kamala Harris like she don't even have the experience. It's just like Breakfast Club com- fell completely off, you know. They probably need to get Jess Hilarious on there just so they can have a, a, a comedian. Maybe it could be funny, but I have no interest in listening to what the Breakfast Club got to say. But just the fact that <clears throat> they would bring some, they would bring Nikki Haley on here, who was with the Trump administration in the, with the campaign. She voted for Trump. She worked in the office with Trump, and now she's bashing Trump saying that she want to be in the office. I'm going to save y'all some time for watching this crap because she spoke on abortion. You know, she spoke on that she's pro-life, but she's not really against somebody from having abortion. It's just she's trying to do her best to get into that election so she can try to win presidency. And because she's a woman, it's the only reason she has a chance because it probably is women that will click up and say, hey, you know, it's a woman. Let's try to get the first black woman. And I think not this year, but probably the next term will probably may get a woman in office just because they pushing for it so hard, you know, and they'll be able to sell more than, you know, the same thing what they did with Obama when they got a black man in office. It was like, okay, now the black person. And it was like, a lot of things was able to be pushed. And we was just down for them because, you know, yes, yeah, it's, it's a black person in office. I think the same thing is going, they're going to do with a woman. It's going to be a woman in office and there's just a lot of stuff that's going to be pushed. All right. So I look at this whole political thing as money grab everybody trying to just get to a spot they really trying to make money you know they trying to bring wealth to their family but do they really care about america i don't think so i think they all puppets in my opinion man that's just me all right i don't really i'm not digging the breakfast club i think that this show fell off miserably it's like you know, just to have her on there and seeing with DJ Clue asking her about Camilla Harris, asking her about, it's like they just trying to stir up some, you know, some talking points and get on the algorithm so they can get clicks and views. But this is the downfall of the Breakfast Club. Okay, Charlemagne is going to keep doing the same thing when he gets on and passes uh, a guest. 
he gonna talk about racism he gonna talk about because he know that it's gonna stir up a lot of you know people and he feels like that's a great way to get clicks and likes and views so um let me know what y'all think about this man you can watch this in its entirety let me know what y'all think but i just feel like uh, this woman paid to get on there to try to run for her presidency and trying to you know get the culture on her side all right but i don't think she did a good job and i think she's getting on to a falling ship where this no one even too much care about the breakfast club no more you know they just running so many shenanigans and so much stuff that we can see right through it that is just for clicks and likes but hey let me know what y'all think man i'll catch y'all in the next video don't forget man the water treatment is in the description i will leave a link to the website where you can get your free water test uh, www.environly.com we're giving you a free water test uh we can give you the equipment you need it's crazy out here with the water you can go to ewg.org put in your zip code and see what your city has been feeling for and we can take all of that stuff out of your water or it's price in the industry so make sure you lock in with us i catch y'all in the next one peace and love are you ready for cleaner safer water throughout your entire home our high efficiency water systems handles just that plus it can be installed in one day by our expert local installers just click below to check local pricing and claim your free water test today.